Okay, Scott, some, uh, some sporting predictions from the weekend. Um, can the USA, Steve Holcomb, add to his two-man bobsleigh bronze by winning the four-man competition this weekend? Uh, I think Steve can. Uh, the only problem they got is it's not a left-hand drive, and I think they struggle because the bob is is a middle seat drive, and uh, uh, for that reason, um, I think he may bronze again. Bronze again. Okay, great. Uh, the UFC's women's bantamweight champion Ronda Rousey faces her toughest fight against fellow Olympic judo medalist Sarah McCann. Both women are unbeaten in their, in their MMA careers. But can Ronda keep hold of her belt and will she be able to finish the highly skilled ground fighter with her trademark armbar? I uh, genuinely haven't understood a word you said uh, and um, never ever come between two women when they're fighting. So this one, I'm afraid you'll have to do yourself. OK, uh, former footballer and current manager of Ghoul AFC, Curtis Woodhouse takes on Darren Hamilton for the British light welterweight title. Where's your money going? Oh, it's going to be a tough one. A football manager fighting. Ooh, there's only going to be a couple of nails in it. There's a couple of nails in it. Will anybody hit anybody? He'll probably go to the 12th round. No cuts. <laughs> Draw. Draw, OK. Manchester United travel to an improving Crystal Palace this Saturday. Will David Moyes be under even more pressure after the game? Oh, I certainly will. You only have a look. Crystal Palace absolutely flying at the moment. Uh, oh, no, no, they're not, are they? No, no. Yeah, unfortunately, from a Liverpool fan, United to win. OK, and finally, does 2010 bronze medalist Andre Myra stand a chance of placing on the podium in the men's slalom? Um, well, the Super G didn't go particularly well, so uh, I think he needs to pull it out of the bag. He's going to do it? Yeah, why not? Go on. Go on.